and welcome along and welcome to another set of fact sheets for Fact Sheet Friday. This week the spotlight is on a pair of cow barns from Horriman along with an automatic feeder from Lely. We've also got a forage mixer wagon from Silo King, two tractors, one from John Deere and the other from New Holland, along with a, a cockling cultivator and a potinger baler. And with just over two weeks left to go before the release of FS22, things are really getting interesting as we're learning more and more about the game all the time. As always, if you like what you see and would like to pre-order Farming Simulator 22, there are links down in the description below that will also help support the channel. So uh, without further ado, let's go take a look at this week's fact sheets. Our first fact sheet this week features the Horriman Cow Barn with a Lely Vector Automatic Feeder. This barn will take 80 cows, will cost 722,500 euros and can take TMR, grass and hay. Next up we have the John Deere 8RX series tractor. This has a power output between 263 and 337 kilowatts or 357 and 458 horsepower. It has a fuel capacity of 851 litres and a DEF capacity of 37 litres. It weighs 20 tonnes and will cost 351,000 euros. It features a variable CVT stroke power shift gearbox and has a maximum speed of 40 kilometers per hour or 24 miles per hour. Here it is paired with the Cockling Vector 800 cultivator. This requires 235 kilowatts or 320 horsepower. It has an 8 meter working width, will cost 68,500 euros, has a weight of 6 Point nine tons and a working speed of 15 kilometers per hour or nine miles per hour. Our third fact sheet features one of my favorites, the New Holland T7 HD series tractor. This produces between 201 and 230 kilowatts or 273 to 313 horsepower. It has a fuel tank between 410 and 630 liters and a DEF tank of 96 liters. It weighs 10.6 tons. It will cost you 227,500 euros, has a variable CVT gearbox and a maximum speed of 50 kilometers per hour or 31 miles per hour. It's paired here with the Pottinger Impress 185 VC Pro Baler Wrapper. This requires 110 kilowatts or 150 horsepower. It produces bales between 125 and 180 centimeters in size. Has a working speed of 17 kilometers per hour or 10 miles per hour. Will cost 99,500 euros. Has a weight of 7.9 tons and can wrap bales between 125 and 150 centimeters in size. Our final fact sheet today features the Silo King Selfline 4.0 Premium 2215-22 Forage Mixer Wagon. This has a power output of 160 kilowatts or 218 horsepower. It has a fuel tank of 200 liters and a DEF tank of 26 liters. It weighs 14.1 tons. It will cost you 204,500 euros, has a variable CBT gearbox, goes a maximum speed of 40 kilometers per hour or 24 miles per hour, and has a capacity of 22 meters squared of total mixed ration forage, hay, straw, silage, and concentrate. It is being used inside the Horriman Cow Barn Large. This will take 80 cows, will cost you 518,500 euros. And this can take total mixed ration, hay and grass. Interestingly, silage does not seem to be a feed type in this barn. So there you have it, another Fact Sheet Friday done and dusted. A couple of surprises in here today. Um, the biggest one for me is the fact that you can't 
feed silage directly to cows anymore. Uh, seems that it has to be mixed in with TMR in both of the two cow barns that we had in these fact sheets. Also, a couple of other interesting things, especially around the balers and bale sizes. Uh, the fact that the, the Protinger baler will produce 180 centimeter bales, but will only wrap up to 150 centimeters is really quite interesting. Lots of new gameplay coming in with Farming Simulator 22. Absolutely loving where this game is going. I cannot wait another two weeks and three days until it's released. As I said, if you do like what you see, then please pop down below, uh, use the links to pre-order Farming Simulator 22 and help support the channel. But I'm gonna leave this video here for this week. So all that remains is for me to say thank you for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed this video. Please give it a like, drop us a comment and give it a share. And for all the latest videos from Virtual Farmer, please subscribe to the channel, ring that bell, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.